be consistent, bro. You gotta be going after it. You have to put time into the things that matter so you can get the results back out. People's dreams come true. You're going to make Elon Musk's dreams come true because all you do is scroll on and play. Where's the time to be falling for these distractions? Where's the time to be partying? You gotta, you gotta lock in if you want a better life for yourself. You have to. people so I'm gonna take you guys through a little bit of a day in life of what I get up to in my life I'm a 25 year old recruiter slash salesperson in, in Dubai so yeah man off to Abu Dhabi now got quite a few client meetings that I need to get done there but yeah man I'm gonna take you lot with me do you know what I like them um, Abu Dhabi a lot more than Dubai I think and the reason for that is it's just a lot less distractions in Abu Dhabi than there is in Dubai and you're still getting you know the top tier lifestyle that you would get in Dubai as well and there's a lot of business opportunities especially for like salespeople, recruiters there's a lot going on within tech so yeah man I'm looking forward to today Probably have my first meeting and then plot up at a coffee shop or something until my next meeting. But yeah, I'll take you lot with me. Let you know how the first one goes. Should be a good day. So first meeting was a success. Really good meeting uh, with a new potential customer. We've got some exciting stuff going on, so I'm uh, looking forward to that one. I'm in the second location now. You see what I mean about Abu Dhabi? Abu Dhabi is nice, man. Really enjoy coming here. Uh, but yeah, at the second location, I'm going to find a, a coffee shop, plot down for a bit, and now just wait, do a bit of work until I've got my next one. That is the meetings done for the day. Today, what? What's the time? 2.55, so had the last meeting just now, had a bit of food, um, but yeah, really wrapped her up and on the way back to Dubai now, I've got about an hour and a half journey back. But yeah, man, it's been a really good day. It's been, you know, I've been here since 9 a.m., pretty much meeting after meeting and then in the calf, working and meeting again. So yeah, man, this is, this is what it's normally like when I come down to Abu Dhabi, because I don't obviously come too often. One thing I really, really like and enjoy about the UAE is that you could literally speak to anyone. Like, I'll give you an example. I was outside just getting some sun away from the cafe and I just started speaking to some guy. Turns out that he's head of software engineering. Obviously for me that's a good thing because I work with you know, head of software engineers to help scale their teams. And next thing you know he's telling me that he's looking for XYZ people and I was like brilliant. Like you, you don't get that in the UK you know, you don't get that anywhere else. Like you just start speaking to someone and then all of a sudden you're working with them. So, yeah, man, I'm, I'm grateful that I'm here. Honestly, it's, uh, it's the place to be, to be honest. But yeah, head back to Dubai now. Probably going to go home, yeah, finish wrapping up my work there. But yeah, I'll take you, take you lot with me. But yeah, I think that's pretty much going to be done for the day. Get home, do a bit more work. I've got a meeting at 3.30. I'm going to just take whilst I'm in the cab. And yeah, pretty much that's it. That's, that's been my day. So, the, the, 20, the, tw the 27 roles that we have open, is this based off of what we've got in terms of the agreement we've put in place with the client, in terms of how much they're paying as a fee? Yes. Yeah? And then, and then also... No, numbers I haven't included at all. Okay, okay, so you just put the... 
Okay, what we need to be billing in terms of getting the margin is that. Just got back home. It's been a really good day, a really productive day, but man, I'm tired, but it doesn't stop yet. Like it's only four o'clock, so I normally work up until about six, seven o'clock. Uh, but then after work, I've, I've got other things that I focus on as well. So, you know, my days are normally from, you know, 6 a.m. in the morning from when I start boxing till sometimes 10, 11 o'clock at night. Uh, but yeah, I've still got quite a few things to do uh, before I wrap the day up. So I think I'm probably going to conclude the video here. To be honest, like after work, I just, you know, eat some food uh, and go to sleep and then repeat, like rinse and repeat. And that is pretty much it, to be honest. No gym today because it's a rest day, uh, but I still make sure that I get, you know, at least 8,000 steps, which I've already hit because I was doing a lot of walking today um, and my boxing session. But yeah, I think this is uh, going to be the wrap of the video. Thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, this was just more a bit of an insight. Obviously, my previous videos, you see that was actually doing online coaching back in the UK. A lot's changed in the last three years. I think that was my last upload. But yeah, I thought I'd give you guys a bit of an insight of what it's like from someone who's relocated from the UK to here in the UAE in Dubai um, and what it's like working out here. You know, you see loads of videos of the millionaires and how they live their life, but this is someone who's, you know, an insight of someone who's actually trying to build something with their life and trying to get to that million status, right? So, look, if you want more videos like this or if you want, you know, any insight of how I moved to Dubai and, you know, how I made it possible, then, then feel free to just reach out to me. Um, or, you know, if there's a high enough demand, not sure if there will be, but uh, I will do a separate video on this. Uh, but yeah, if this video does really well, like in terms of views, then I'm, I'm definitely going to keep this up. Um, I just started doing this just basically to work back on, on the personal branding side of things. There's just such an important thing to be doing in this time and age. So, so yeah, look, thank you very much for tuning in, guys. If you, if you like the video, make sure you like, subscribe, all of that stuff. Um, any questions, I'm more than happy to just answer. Peace.